there was a picture of her hand on a tree that was taken in Byron Bay, and that's where it stemmed from. We wanted to create a theme for her final journey, and the Tree of Life was the, the foundation of her journey. So that night I started looking for Greenfleet, or a company that could do it, and I could find many others, but eventually found Greenfleet, and then I emailed them at about 9.30 that night, 9.30, 10.30 that night, and Justin email rang me in the morning, and he goes, we've never done this before, and I've gone, I just need a yes or no answer, man. Can you do it? Can't you do it? And he goes, yes, we can. I hadn't told no one until I got the contact from Greenfleet to say, yes, we can. And then I told the family, then I told Faye, and she was wrapped. I didn't want people to spend money on flowers. I didn't want people to spend money on research. I wanted to spend something on something that will help the environment, but also make her memory last forever more than anything else. So the vision was a thousand trees. We ended up with two. 2,000 trees. In August we planted with the family and that was just a, a happy day. It wasn't a sad day. We didn't want anybody to be sad. So most of the people that came, everybody donated a dollar to whatever. So they felt connected. Whereas you go to a cemetery, there's no connection. It's a headstone, you do what you do and you leave. A flower, you give somebody a flower, it dies tomorrow morning, you throw it away. Whereas here, it just keeps growing and growing and growing. And that's what we wanted to leave. That's what I wanted to leave for her. And as I said, green fleet, from the time we started with Greenfleet, it's always been, we've never done it before, but we'll help you, we'll help you from a website modifications to all these things. When you're donating money, it's different to when you actually see the end product. Um, it's like building a house. You see something on a plan, but you don't see it until you move in. Here's the same thing, you know, and when we were planting the first 250 trees, that was inspiring. I spend time sometimes to come have a coffee in the morning. I'm with the kangaroos amongst my trees, uh, her trees, and it's nice. You know, cemetery is good, but this is much, much better.